Hi everybody, Greg Agee here. Today I'll be showing you a step-by-step -step way to cut out images in Photoshop. Now, there are many different ways to cut out objects in Photoshop, but we're going to be focusing on the best way, which is the Quick Selection tool. Now, this tool works best when you have an image where the object and background have very distinct and contrasted edges. We'll be working with two images. One will be the flower image on top, which will cut out the second image of the water, which will be the background for the flower. So the first thing we want to do is go to the Tools palette and select the Quick Selection tool. The tool works by clicking and dragging over the area that we want to select, which in this case is the flower. Now as we continue to click and drag, you'll notice the selection lines will jump to the edges of the flower. Once we have what we want, release the mouse button. Making sure that we're on the flower layer, we'll go down and create a layer mask by clicking on the layer mask icon. This will immediately cut out the flower, allowing the image of the water to show through. Now if you look at the flower, it has some black edges around it that we need to get rid of, so it blends in a little bit better. So we're going to click on the layer mask, which brings up the properties panel. Then we'll click on the mask edge button to make some adjustments to the selection. Click on the decontaminate colors box. We're going to adjust the shift edge option to minus 40%. And then we're going to change the feather to one pixel and then click OK. And there we go. We have our new cutout of the flower placed onto its new water background, just like it's always been there. This has been Greg Agee with the Photoshop tip on a step-by-step -step way to cut out images in Photoshop.